Good morning, Marys. It's the afternoon. And that's an airplane. So this video is slightly overdue. When I hit 500,000 subscribers, I wanted to make a thank you video, letting you guys know how much I appreciate you. And um, I hadn't done it up until now. So that's what you're in for. Stay tuned until the very end because I have details about a meetup happening tomorrow in New York City at the Nintendo World Store. But uh, just, just wait. Just wait, let me thank you first. The other day I had this moment where I was looking back and thinking about my life and where I was, you know, five, six years ago. And it's crazy to think how far I've come in just that short amount of time. And it's, it's all because of YouTube. And it's so cool because there's people out there that actually love me and care about me and want to watch my stuff and be a part of my life. And I think that's so amazing because not only do you want to be a part of my life, but you let me be a part of yours. And even if it's in such a small way, um, I am so honored that you guys let me do that. I don't know if you guys truly know how much I love you. When I meet you guys in real life, I almost feel like I'm more excited to meet you than uh, you even know. It's so cool matching a face to something that is normally a comment or a tweet or a Facebook post. And I realized there may be some reservations about this feeling because back in the day when I would post on Brokers of the Hill 88's YouTube videos, I'd leave a comment and I'm like, man, there's like hundreds of comments coming in. This person's not going to see my comment at all or even know I exist. And I was just like, oh, I just want to post it anyways because I want them to know they're cool and I like their videos and maybe, maybe they'll see it. But I may not always respond, but I read all of my comments, all of my tweets, all of my emails, um, we read all the letters, and I love you guys, and you are so important to me. If I could, I would go to every single one of your basketball games, your soccer games, your baseball games, your dance recital, your uh, band rehearsal uh, performance thing, I don't know, whatever it was, if I could go to those things and be there and there was a million of me, like, that's how much I care about you. And I want you to know that I am so proud of you, and I think you guys are amazing, and being able to hear about your, your stories and your life and what's going on with you is always so touching to me. When I'm having a bad day, and I'm sad, and, you know, on Life Bird, we've seen a lot of ups and downs. Like, oh my goodness, it's been a mess, and I'm always so honest. It's really hard to hide things from you guys. I try and be like, oh, just put on a face, I just... I just won't post a video. I just like they won't they won't know. But I can't. I just have to be honest with you guys because I feel like that's always been the way I've been on Life Bray from day one. It's just complete honesty. When I'm having those moments, I feel so incredibly loved because you guys just uh, surround me with encouraging words and tell me your stories and how you're feeling and you can relate to me. And I'm so encouraged by that. And it's just it's such an awesome community that we have here. And um, I don't think I would be nearly as successful uh, on Strawberry 17, just being completely honest, if I hadn't started vlogging. You guys got me through my hard times. And I feel like there is this really interesting community here on LifeBerry. And you guys are all so nice whenever I collab with people. One of the number one things I hear is about how awesome you guys are. Usually when you collab with people, you get an interesting mix of a new audience, like a new wave comes in and you're like, oh no, they may not like me or they may be mean, like you never know what's going to happen. But I feel like we have this really amazing track record because everyone I collab with, they always tell me like, your subscribers are so nice. And that makes me feel a million times more amazing. You know, like I love you guys, but like when I hear that, I'm just like, yes, we're cool, I'm proud of you guys. Come on now, let's have a dance party. I love every single one of you, and I appreciate you so much. And if we ever get the chance to meet, please have a conversation with me because I want to know about you. I want to know about your life. I want to know about what you're doing. I want to know your favorite color. Like, I am so excited to see you. I think sometimes watching a YouTuber, it can feel like a very one-sided relationship because you know a lot about them, but they don't know a lot about you. And with you guys, like, I do. I want to know about you. So, so take the time. Don't be afraid. Don't feel like, oh, you're just going to say hi and then keep on going. Like... At VidCon, the last day of VidCon, I was just hanging out in the lounge talking to people and it was so cool hearing everyone's stories. Like, it was just some like really, really awesome time that I genuinely value. Life is crazy. You never know where you're gonna end up. And I feel emotional thinking about this. And <laughs> I try not to cry. I'm like a sad crier. I make people cry when I cry. But um, I'm just so glad I didn't give up on living. I think it's it was seven years ago now. Right around this time too, 
and I'm glad I didn't. Because if I had given up when things were hard and it didn't feel like they could ever get better, I wouldn't be living the life I'm living now and I wouldn't have the opportunity to be a part of yours. I'm just really grateful. And I'm kind of just having this moment where I look at my life and I wake up every morning and I'm so happy. And I am probably the happiest I've ever been in a really long time. Not to say that I haven't been happy in the past, but I am just, I'm just happy. And it feels nice. And you guys are a big part of that. I pray every night for you guys and I'm always so grateful and I thank God for everything that he's given me. And, um... Being able to be on YouTube and do what I do is just probably the coolest thing in the world. Oh, <sighs> sorry, I'm done. I'm done being emotional. I, I can get there. I can go there sometimes, but it just really is just, it's a lot. It's a lot when you think about it. Now moving on to the meetup. <laughs> Dramatic change of subject. I am headed to New York. Tonight, I'm hopping on a red eye and I'm going to New York and um, I'm getting my nails done. <laughs> Really, like, the, the, I never thought I'd ever say that in a million years. But I'm getting my nails done. Um, Nintendo is flying me out there. And uh, there's this really amazing nail artist who's going to be doing my nails. So I'll be posting vlogs for the next couple of days from that. And um, I'm really excited because uh, I've had this Adventure Time nail polish, which I love. And I kind of don't want to take off. But I think it's time. I think it's time for some new nail art. We'll see what happens. But I'm going with my friend Arden, and tomorrow we have a lot of free time, so I thought, why not have a meetup at the Nintendo World Store? So we're having it tomorrow night, Thursday, at 6.30 p.m. I'll leave more information down below, but if you live nearby and you want to come hang out, please do. I want to meet you guys. I want to talk to you guys. Bring your 3DS if you have one. We'll like, you know, we'll play some Mario Kart, we'll do something. I've never been to the Nintendo World Store, so I, I heard it's like really amazing. I've seen pictures, but that's it. Arden will be with me. We did a Mad Libs together a while back, so come meet her too because she's really freaking funny and such a hoot. But if you don't live in New York City, don't worry. I am planning this world tour with Lucas and a whole bunch of other people, and it is going to be oh so cool, guys. Speaking of which... I finished the EP today, and I'm getting finals on Sunday, so um, we'll be releasing the album in November. More details on that soon. But when we do the world tour, believe me, it's going to be a freaking dance party, and I will get the chance to meet all of you guys, which I'm even a million times more excited about. But that's it for this video. I have to get packing, or else I am going to miss my flight, <laughs> which I do quite frequently. It's always the worst when that happens. I'll see you guys later. Bye!